Hello and welcome to Commander Clash. This week we've all chosen commanders from the Time Spiral block to build around. And let's start it off with Richard. What are you running? I'm running Endrix Sar Master Breeder. So 5 to cast 2-2. Two, two. When you cast a creature spell, put X-1-1 one, one Black Thrall creature tokens on the battlefield. So I really wanted to make like a Fallen Empire's Thrall deck. <laughs> Turns out the Thrall tribe did not get a lot of support over the years from WotC. <laughs> so I have some Thrall, Thrall Matters card, but this is more going to be a Sacrifice Creature Matters deck because I, I just really couldn't make <laughs> Thralls work unless I moved to like Changelings. Oh man, I know there's a bunch of Fallen Empire Thralls, but I know they're all terrible, so I, I'm very curious to see which ones you end up running. <laughs> a lot of them were reprinted in Master's Edition, so I was really worried because it was Fallen <laughs> Empires that we couldn't get them on Moto, but actually some of the really bad ones are in Master's Edition. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, Endric looks awesome. I've, I've played with him before. Makes a lot of tokens, lots of sacrifice abilities. He's cool. I'm very, I'm very excited to see how it turns out. All right, Seth, what are you running? I'm running Felon of Havenwood, which is sort of this weird fungus lord. Uh, <laughs> so I am playing basically fungus tribal. I have fungus cards and fungus matters cards in kind of a sapling token theme because that's what the fungus most of them do so we'll see it's different than a lot of my decks because it is a pretty straightforward tribal decks without too many tricks i think i have one way that i can potentially end the game instantly i don't think i win oh. but i think the game <laughs> the game would come to an end if i managed to pull off my one combo <laughs> very sweet i i can't think of any any fungus creatures off the top of my head. I know it's like phallids, but I don't remember what they do. So this is really cool. And I just now realized that he's actually uh, Golgari colors because of that activated ability. I thought he was mono green the entire time. Pretty sweet. <laughs> I'm excited to see how that turns out. <laughs> and Tom, what are you running? I'm running... Um, I mentioned on Twitter that this was going to be kind of a deck that I built with a couple of viewers a long time ago, and it is. Uh, this is the first 10 ticket challenge deck. Um, so it's Caravac the Merciless, uh, who's a 7 mana 5 4. Whenever an opponent casts a spell, he deals damage to a creature or player equal to the spell is converted to mana cost. I love this guy. I think he's super underrepresented, and I can't wait to show, uh, to just play this deck. I really do like it, and it kind of, uh, when I was putting the deck up on MTG Goldfish, I was surprised. It's actually under $8. So. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah, nice. I'm super excited to try it out. <laughs> really cool. Yeah, Carework is awesome. A lot of group pain. Just mm -hmm. knocks out a lot of damage really well. Cool stuff. And this is Tomer. I'm running Norn the Wary. Uh, whenever a player basically does anything, casts a spell or, or a creature attacks, uh, Norn is exiled and he returns to the battlefield at the next end step. So... Pretty straightforward general. Uh, he's oddball because you don't really see him too much, but building him is pretty straightforward. You want to take advantage of enter the battlefield triggers because he's just going to be exiting and entering the battlefield basically every single turn multiple times. Um, so I'm going to I built shenanigans around that and it should be pretty fun. Uh, starting hands. Um... <laughs> I think I'm gonna mulligan mine. It just doesn't do anything. This is much better. Ugh. I have I have cards that work well with Norin, but I feel like they're gonna get me so much hate. <laughs> <laughs> like right off the bat and I have like no ramp, no nothing. Uh you know what, I'm not gonna be too greedy, I'm just gonna keep it see see what happens. Well I have seven drops <laughs> and swamps. So I will mulligan. I might just exit the game very quickly. <laughs> uh, this hand is okay. Not the best hand, but... Alright. I'm really excited to see you guys' decks. I'm not going to lie. I know a little bit about Norin. Not too much, but I've never seen either Endrixar or Thelen, so I'm super excited. Yeah, I've never seen Thelen. I've seen Endric as part of the 99, and I've also seen Kervik as part of the 99 in like group slug decks. But yeah, I've never seen decks actually built around them and i've never seen uh thrills 
actual <laughs> thrill support card. So yeah, <laughs> so I don't even know what what set they would be in. I'm very confused. <laughs> I've never seen a Thrall token, so we're going to see what a Thrall token looks like today. <laughs> what edition? Because tokens... Ha- have there been recent Thrall tokens? Or were Thralls from the era before Magic Official tokens? I, I, I think they printed one in a dual deck because there weren't any from the original set. So there's yeah. a <laughs> dual deck Thrall token. Well, I got zero one Thralls and one one Thralls, so we're going to figure out... <laughs> we're going to figure out what They have two what tokens, tokens. That's- Pretty impressive. Turn one commander, so overpowered. <laughs> better than a Sol Ring in this case. Oh man. I don't know if it's literally better than a Sol Ring. Hey, I did it right. It went to the exile zone. Huzzah. And a Whoa. thought vessel. Oh my, what? Slow down, <laughs> Seth. <laughs> uh, off to a good start. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I had a. <laughs> Wait, does this tap for mana? It does. All right. There we go. I had a turn one commander, but I guess you beat me there. Well, I guess Soul Ring is pretty good. I'll try that off for size two. <laughs> Norin is going to drive you insane. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Auto yield. Oh, wait. Can Kervik take care of Norin? Because of the stack? Maybe? I'm not too sure. I Again, I don't play against so Norin sad. too often. <laughs> that would be like because- the super counter. Can you even auto-yield, though, because it's a new object each time? No. So you're probably going to have to click it every single time anyone casts a spell for the entire game. Oh, why did I choose this guy? All right, I'm getting in for some damage. Watch out. He hits for two. No, he doesn't. Wait, wait, he doesn't? Oh, it's any creature. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, he, he's getting in there. He's get, he's going to try. And it's gone. <laughs> oh, I love him already. <laughs> All right, this is why I'm getting the hate. Oh, no. Impact Here we Tremors. That's Everybody, a combo. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have a soul ring or a thought vessel, but I'm going to ping the heck out of you. I'm off to a blazing start here. <laughs> He's really hard to kill too. Uh, I mean, you need Kier- like a stifle and Kier- a removal Kier- spell. Might potentially just shut down my deck entirely. It's not oh. like I'm actually running much creature removal either. Well, I guess I'm just gonna keep ramping. If it's not broken, don't fix it. That's a so I much don't ramp. I don't actually have many expensive things in my deck, unfortunately. Fungus kind of top out at five mana, <laughs> I learned. There's no, like, X cost fungus? Fungi? There's a couple of fungus matters cards that cost a little bit more, but not that much more. Hmm. Like, a, what's. There's, like, a fungus lord or a, a sapperling lord. Verd, Verdloth? The ancient? That's kind of an X spell, sort of. Hmm. Oh! Oh, hold up. Let me do. A, let me undo a lot of those things. Whoa, I did that so badly. Okay. It doesn't just give me the... Hmm? Oh, ew. Never mind. It's something with the slide keep? Yeah, I, re- I, I, I knew it was bad, but I didn't know it was this bad. So... <laughs> well, you, That's you pretty had, much what's going on. You had some experience with it when you mind-slavered Seth last video. Yep. Remember you had the white-blue white version? Mm-hmm. Spoilers for people who didn't see it, but you should watch it because it was awesome. Yay! Norn goes away. <laughs> oh, what is this deck? <laughs> you probably are just going to kill us with impact tremors. Yeah, I'm only going to die in like three turns. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, once he's actually dealt with, I don't really have much of a follow up, but if you don't deal with him. Well, soon, you can just recast him, right? I guess, but if Kervik uh, deals with it, then I'm just done. What is Kervik actually deals with it? Well, you cast a spell, then Kervik's ability triggers, and then he can target Norn. I think if you if you can if the stack works, so that Norn way, will or, blink first, right? Will he? Like it depends Act- on which goes active first. Active player gets the trigger first. But what if I'm not the active player? Mm. It might depend on whose turn it is. I think yeah, so. so. Oh wait, I see what you're saying. Uh, I don't know. I just want to tap out, so I'm going to do this. <laughs> <laughs> 
Wait, no, <laughs> no, I should have. Ca- oh, I didn't attack with Norin. Wow. Uh, he's got away with murder. Oh no, I missed one damage. Everybody. My deck is so good. <laughs> <laughs> Three turns of passing. I need a bad really? rock. You didn't keep any any rocks in hand. No, I already mulliganed once already. Oh, the well, looks I didn't so expect someone to like triple ramp <laughs> over here. <laughs> what is this it's, savage it's, salad? It's fungus time. Three spore counters. Put a one-one sapling. All right, you can sacrifice. Ooh, that's like good board presence right there. Resiliency. Sacrifice one to regenerate target fungus. <laughs> and wait, does he give? He gives fungus creatures, but not saprolings. R- yes, that's okay. correct. Okay. All right. How high of a pick is Savage Ballad in, in draft? It's it's basically unplayable. <laughs> <laughs> Two toughness is so bad. Ooh, Krenko. Oh no! I hear that makes a lot of goblins. Oh, do you remember yeah. that game, Tomer, where you like? comboed off and killed everyone was, wasn't that with Cranko? yeah <laughs> i was playing as that deck and you know i was like you know what's a, what would be fair in this deck Cranko and like mana flare or whatever the thing that made me a ton of mana <laughs> yeah that was not <laughs> that was not the best idea whatever i had fun <laughs> <laughs> it was sweet. that's all that matters uh, I Earth got to. Rust. Oh yeah. By no. the way, that's why. That's why I was like, I'm probably just gonna get hated out because I had four lands, impact tremors, and perforos <laughs> just as my start. Oh my gosh! <laughs> so oh, it's, it was okay. Ooh, it's okay. It's all you. I'm just stacking them now. <laughs> oh no! No! Oh Jesus! Whoa. Almost skipped my whole turn. Suited for next commander clash. <laughs> Uh, so I think Tomer's the enemy. We should probably be attacking yeah. him. Uh, I don't understand why. I, I'm doing nothing. Look, I just have a Norin and a Kobold out. This is the quickest start I think I've seen from a Norin deck before. <laughs> Yay! Oh, uh, oh, that'll work! What? What's that? Mag to the uh, Abyss. Oh, no. Uh, How do I... Alright, here we go. Oh, I don't like that at all. But why? Alright, so I guess I sack my commander. I have to, like, click select, I guess, and not just click on it. So I get a counter. Ooh. You can make a sapperling with that counter. Oh, wait, no, you need three. Ooh, harmonize. Ooh. Draw some cards. <laughs> I'm at 27. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> oh, it's so silly. <laughs> So I'm going to do this for the greater good. Cause do I, not I, take out my kobolds. What, what oh, was that? Oh. What? Oh, that, was, that was not right. Wait, like where's Franco? the morbid? You should have yeah. morbid. I should have oh, morbid. Because he didn't die. He Instead of yeah. there was a replacement effect, he went to the command zone. So he didn't oh, die. Oh, because it was your commander. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's so disappointing. Did you want to get I, rid of... I want to get rid of your token to hopefully kill your Norin with yeah, the Magus of the Abyss, but I was going to kill Cranko and your token, but yeah. I didn't think of my commander not actually dying. Well, I'm going to attack you anyway. Maybe you'll block. <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> hey, they're back! Okay, that Hello. is... Disgusting. It needs to stop. <laughs> <laughs> it will soon. Well, I'll be over soon. I I totally would have targeted the token if I had realized because Krenko would have died anyway. I guess you could have made a token I with the ability on the stack. Fun. I could just do that on my upkeep and then say that the Kobold died. That's yeah. true, but then you'd have to skip your whole turn, though. Mm. Basically. Just kill the Kobold. Kill the Kobold. All right. Uh, ooh. Um. No, I like hand. Boop. Oh. Oh, yeah. so he does go. This he does go first. Yeah. That makes me sad. Makes me very happy. <laughs> well, because you did like your nine turn. Here. If it was another turn, then it would be, I think, the other way around. Yeah. Like, this is still not okay. Yeah, we're, we're <laughs> dying. <laughs> Well, you have a really good answer for now, but I mean, oh my. 
<laughs> I, I'm at 16 after this. You're fine. <laughs> oh, wait. Just, just a scratch. Whatever. And there's a Kravik out, which is going to... Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't even know if I can cast anything. I don't know oh. if we're going to make it anywhere. Well, Kravik's going to be going for my stuff, I'm assuming. <laughs> yes, 100% every single time. Just Oh, you get to, you get to oh, choose. Oh, it's a target? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was everyone. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I oh we can totally bow down to over here by casting lots of spells. Mm -hmm. okay. Just cast everything, guys. But why? Like everything. <laughs> I'll get rid of the creatures. I'll get rid of his face. It'll be great. No. <laughs> That's not what I like. I'm already at 13. So. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Look at everybody's all titles. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. Uh, I, I don't know if I have a way to get rid of Perforos, though. I don't think I have anything that exiles. Norn. Just, just cast your biggest thing every single turn. We'll get rid of them really quickly. Well, oh, one more. Four, on. four mana. Do you have some dark rituals? I don't have anything useful here. <laughs> you know, this black enchantment interaction. <laughs> well, you <here> comes <laughs> my commander. <laughs> it is. So Not the face. Oh that. my god, that's... Carefrick's actually going to kill me pretty fast, though. Uh, I do get to library. That could be good. Thank or not. I don't think I can kill you <laughs> this turn, so I think Kervik does it. I think I need two turns, because I need to cast Norn, and then I probably need to wheel, but that costs five mana. Well, I can tutor, and maybe find something helpful. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, Kervik's doing pretty good work. We might be able to record two games today. Probably. Yeah, that's <laughs> this is gonna end quick, regardless. <laughs> like... One way or another, someone's dying. <laughs> Yay, red! Uh, <laughs> oh man, am I gonna live another turn? Uh, what are the odds? Have... I so mean, I'm going to. Gain life? <laughs> I don't have a way to kill you this turn, but I could do some damage, and then Kervik's probably gonna finish you off. That's what I think is gonna go down. Uh, so I gotta get something that does things right away. You have Is to, that what you're telling you have me, to deal with my. Yeah. You have to at least deal with Perforos, because that's doing two each. And then you have to deal with Kervuk at some point. Probably yeah, within a turn. That's step two. Step yeah. one is you're at 14, and he has a Perforos and Impact Tremors out. <laughs> uh, so many phthalids, and they just don't... <laughs> the phthalids. Don't do much. Uh. <laughs> Um, but he just need another counter. Then he can regenerate something. <laughs> so close. <laughs> uh, how much mana do I have? Not much. He needs to draw some cards with Sylvan Library. Uh, did I really not put any <laughs> enchantment removal on this deck? Oh, no. Well, it's not just removal. You have to do exile. Perforos is indestructible because he is a god. That's the coolest creature subtype. Just god. That's awesome. All right, whatever. If you if you kill me, you kill me. I guess. <laughs> I mean, I don't necessarily. Well, oh, oh, oh. Well, how about this? You'll you'll be the last person to die that I'll kill. Sweet. <laughs> because you're at the you highest level. You total. might be able to kill Tomer. Tomer's at twenty one. I'm at twenty one. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> you don't have regen up. <laughs> so this is a card that I love desperately. I really started playing in uh, Lorwyn. And uh, this is Dinner of the Fire Herd. Ooh. Oh, is that something with haste and death? No. It's, uh, <laughs> it's, it's a bit more fun. <laughs> oh. Put a... F yeah, put a 5-5 five, five black red elemental onto the battlefield. Target opponent sacks a creature for each black creature you control. Then a land for each red creature you control. Oh, that's cool. that's hurtful. Oh, I got the wrong card if this was going to happen. Oh, it's target opponent. Okay, that's that's fine. Uh, I think that's it for me. I can recast Norn and that's it. I mean, uh, I don't have anything better to do and I'm dead anyway, so I might as well just go for maximum damage. Doot the do. <laughs> this game out. is going to go so quick. <laughs> this is out. the fastest commander class. <laughs> go for it. Uh, I'm at don't, nine. Don't don't cast anything, Richard. Do it. Wait, Nard what? must go in. <laughs> you, don't, you don't want me to cast something? Actually, 
Well, if you don't cast anything, I can get rid of Perforos and Impact Tremors and Whoa. all of Tom's stuff. What? But if you cast something, I'm going to die to Craven. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> all right. Uh, I'll accept that. <laughs> oh, but I want to use my commander. Yeah, Yeah, you want to use your commander. Just, just, <laughs> just, just wait. It'll be good. But you're missing the whole you... turn. Look at the like the efficiency of that turn. That's efficiency of zero. <laughs> Where's my slash deck? All right. Six out of six swamps were untamped and unspent. Think about that. I'll believe in Seth. You didn't All even right. attack. I don't get attack. <laughs> Me? I wouldn't block, I swear. <laughs> oh, don't get All rid right. of my enchantments. <laughs> They're all I have. <laughs> yes. What oh, is this? What is this? Yeah, that you can get rid of everything. I'm so confused. Oh, you'll see. It's gonna be really fun. Oh, is this? Please. Yes. <laughs> what is it? Oh, Great Aurora. <laughs> I see. Uh, Cause Kravik, if I took one damage off your stuff, Kravik would have killed me with it on the stack, and it wouldn't have resolved. <laughs> oh, but Norin's getting exiled. I mean, I'm so still I gonna kill you, nine. Even... No, this is the worst of all outcomes. Oh, I got Kravik back. I mean, oh I'm... dear, this was the worst <laughs> draw ever. <laughs> Did you not get lands? Oh no! <laughs> Wait till <laughs> you guys see this. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I choose all lands. That's usually correct. I just had no... I had so few permanents. But I had a lot of lands. Oh, no! Give me a lot ghost quarter. <laughs> it doesn't even tap. Why are you doing this? <laughs> uh, I didn't realize it would be that bad for you. <laughs> that is oh, fantastic. <laughs> that is fantastic. I'm sorry. It was very funny, though. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm still about to die, but... <laughs> no, uh, you, you've stabilized it, too. You got this now. I don't have any instant speed ramp here, so okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. The idea was it would take advantage of all of the sapling tokens I could use. That's why it's in my deck, but... The Great Aurora, that is. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. He's back! Oh, no one's still like this. What? <laughs> He's back! He's ready to, to, to fight and do stuff. I don't have any of the uh, pingers in, anymore in my hand, though, as I only have two cards. Well, thank gosh. <laughs> that was not, not the best Aurora for me, folks. <laughs> it, Yo, it was better my lands. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it could have been worse. No black it could have been worse. <laughs> <laughs> Watch well, has become a really long clash now. <laughs> that would be pretty funny, actually. <laughs> oh, if we're all just setting stuff up, let's just play a sphere and pass. Can someone ghost quarter me? <laughs> <laughs> you can ghost I mean, quarter I can you. copy it with the Thespian stage and then ghost quarter you, but <laughs> I don't think I'll be doing that. I don't know if I... This, this conference is like the only way I can get back into this. I mean, not really. <laughs> You're pretty sure you wanted that to be a swamp. <laughs> uh <laughs> Well, phase is looting. Hopefully get some action, Roni. Uh, I would be so dead to Norin if he wasn't such a wary attacker. I meant exactly <laughs> Norin damage. <laughs> uh, I mean, this does... Eh. Tuck, tuck, scrapper? The scrapper? Scrapper? The scrapper. Okay. Taking out that Rectus. Oh, I take a damage too, I forgot. Yeah. He does damage equal to converted mana cost, and guess who's back? Oh, thank god you didn't go after me. What do you mean? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. That, no, that would have been lethal. I, I don't want to kill I don't want to kill Seth right now. <laughs> oh <laughs> on, on on the threat scale I have Richard at the lowest. <laughs> and then I have what? Seth, Show and then I respect. have Tom, because Tom actually can kill No! Care my graveyard! Really? Oh, well, I guess he's a black player. I thought you were going to target me, because I have faceless looting. Oh, he also has faceless looting. 
Yeah, I'm going to assume the Rakdos deck has scarier things to do. I mean, I just had Faithless looting, but... So I guess that was that was the superior play. All right, so cards that I'm not going to cast this game. <laughs> uh, uh, probably <laughs> Archdemon, oh, no. Lord Overlord, oh. from the Abyss. Oh, they're so good. <laughs> <laughs> Lake of the Dead, just sacrifice a swap. Oh, wait. <laughs> Are you like Demon Tribal? Uh, I may have some demon finishers because they require you to sacrifice stuff. I like nice. it. Where's the Thalid? Right. They're coming. <laughs> Show me your fungi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tomer. Alright, we'll go go with the Guild Mage first. Alright. I love this card. That's sweet. Makes Sapperling tokens. <laughs> does. And then we will play a fungus. Hey. Okay. That's it. <laughs> Actually, one of the better ones, I think. Yeah, it's, it's quite people exactly. when everyone's like sub ten life. <laughs> well, I can't finish you off now. You have a formidable army. Mm -hmm. That's that's it. <laughs> <laughs> something else to do. The magic of the aurora. <laughs> oh, attack Tom. Hey. Yep. Siege Gang Commander, maybe? Whoa! Oh, Whoa. Okay. oh god. So, Seth. <laughs> well, that was a good draw. We're friends, right? Yeah, we're friends. All right. Def so... Definitely friends. No no, no goblins going your way for now. But, yep. uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's scary. That is pretty scary. <laughs> Where's that swamp? It doesn't even do anything. <laughs> I have like all these lands, none of them are swamps, even though I played 32. Oh. Alright. <laughs> do a poor cutthroat. Oh, no. That might incidentally kill Seth. Yup. Yeah. <laughs> possible. Uh, come on. Come on, something that gains life. Oh Norin. What? Oh no. Oh no. I'm just waiting for. Ooh. <laughs> oh, that that's not good. Well, there goes no! Seth. Oh, the targeting Seth. No, just each creature deals one damage to his controller. Oh, you should have did that in response to Seth like hitting Tomer. You should. <laughs> well, he wasn't uh, going to. Oh, well, if he doesn't, under... you can kill him on the spot. Ouch. Yeah, the siege gang commander. Oh, yeah. well, I, I don't want to take four. Boop. <laughs> <laughs> Boo. <laughs> I guess it was bound to happen. Yeah, two life is not very much. <laughs> no. All right, Tom, how do we? Uh... <laughs> how do we get out of this? That's we... a wonderful question that I don't know the answer to. You got that damnation in there? <laughs> do -do -do. I have, I have a way to get rid of his board. Whoa! I don't like the sound of that. So I mean, that's kind of what I have to do. I don't think you can get rid of Norn though. Ooh! I cannot. That's true. I cannot get rid of Norn. That is impossible. Well, he is always there. Boop. That's fair. Got to get some value out of him. Mm -hmm. Goodbye, my lovely goblins. Ah, oh, I got I got drained. All right, storage counter it is, and pass. <laughs> He's back. It's getting really close. <laughs> He's back. Oh, I really don't need multiples of these effects. Uh if I could cast any of my spells, <laughs> just any of them. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even have a second black source, like. No, I don't even have a swamp or a. This is insane. <laughs> one black source. You guys are really lucky that Norn cannot attack. <laughs> I am so happy Norn can't attack. Um. I guess I'll get rid of this. And. Oof. Ah, uh, the. Uh, I think I'm gonna go for the the risky play. Uh oh, what does that mean? Get rid of re reiterate. Whoa! I know. Might have been a misplay, but I wanted oh, some damage. I wanted some damage on the board. 
<laughs> this is not ramp here. This is this is straight up damage. I'm going for that. I love it so much. <laughs> All right. Oh! We're, up, we're up to three oh, mana. Oh, no. Nice. I still can't the, do anything. The, the, cabal still can't, <laughs> the Cabal still can't tap for mana. Oh. Oh, it's two black, more black. <laughs> uh, Well, I guess we just play Vampiric Rites. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. That's good with your commander. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and uh, we just pass. And hope the top deck another small. <laughs> <laughs> Have a puppeteer click. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. I love this card. That is. Uh oh. It's over, that, right? Oh no, that but that's gonna get the demons. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah, I don't have a response to that. Uh <laughs> oh, can I you could bog myself somehow? It's the speed. Oh no, the Thespian <laughs> Five. I know it's doing No, that wouldn't even work with Jukabog. Oh no. I just know it's doing a lot of damage. Oh, that's that's a good that's a good choice. Let me just sacrifice this whole thing. Oh, I can't even sacrifice it. It costs three. What? <laughs> oh, and I can't undo. Well, okay, those are uh, those are a lot of things. <laughs> well, it's a good thing we have all that graveyard hate. Oh, it has haste too. Are you kidding me? Yeah. <laughs> it's over. Can you lightning bolt him? <laughs> uh, I can tell you the last card in my hand was fork. So. Nice. Oh, I probably should have put an upkeep stop for my burnish chart. Mm. All right, Pover, go quarter me, man. <laughs> I, I can't this turn. Uh. It's going to be tapped. Uh. Yep. Uh, I'm going to go in for a huzzah. Last hurrah. Swinging. <laughs> <laughs> Always yield. Take it. Take it. Oh, I'm oh. gonna block. Oh, it has persist. <laughs> Why would you do this, Dover? <laughs> <laughs> Never. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, Richard, I have a fork in hand. What you gotta do is you gotta play a good oh. instant or sorcery. I will Ooh. fork mm -hmm. it, and we we double the trouble. Wait, what happens to the fork if there's an X spell? It copies the X. It, yeah. it copies the X? It does. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Is it Black Sun <laughs> Zenith? For, for one? <laughs> oh my god, that would be perfect. I wouldn't even be mad. It'd just be amazing. Alright. <laughs> do it. Do it. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Tom's at four. I might be able to kill him. Wait, what? what? He has so many flyers, though. Are you going to, like, exsanguinate him? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> no way. Oh, if Richard wins oh. this, no way. He's drawn a land every single turn. This is insane. Uh, if Richard wins this, I don't know. This Cabal Coffers is nothing, right? Yeah. No. Alright, uh, target player loses X life. It's profane oh. command. <laughs> is that the only one I could do? Nothing else seems very useful in profane command right now. I mean, taking out Tom would mean that you don't die. Alright. So, target player loses X life and return target creature convert mana costs X or less. If, if, what? If, Tom. if you target Tomer, though, then he'll fork it at Tom, and won't you just win? Because Tomer will do it out of spite. I won't do it out of spite. I don't know <laughs> if I trust this. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just take it and let Tom win. Uh, okay. Alright. I just had to fade one land. One land, that's <laughs> all. It's a single land. I like this. Goodbye, Norn. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Double goodbye, Norn. This is the best for fade command I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, do I even get anything back? I don't! Uh, Why is it only X2? <laughs> Why did I copy this? I thought I was going to get something back. Oh, the fail. You can change the targets. I think you need to kill Tom before he plays his commander and we all die. I'll leave you alive. I'm very in on Wait, did you kill an Armado Black player. Did, did you target me with the first one, Richard? Oh. No? I played a Tom. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, 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 no, no, no. Tom's going to die now. 
<laughs> Sorry, Tom. Ah, <laughs> uh, I needed to fade one land. Ugh, that's disgusting. Good game, guys. It's a good game. Okay. I think Richard's gonna win this. I have a I have a mountain in hand. So Well, you're gonna die to a one one beatdown. <laughs> oh no. I still got nothing. It's very possible. <laughs> Do I even like copy anything of his? No, probably not. Alright, Norin, let's <laughs> Well, Nice. Oh, do it. <laughs> Wait. I'm gonna oh, copy no. it. <laughs> yes. A good buy swap. <laughs> Zula, Zula Port Cutthroat's gonna get there, though. It's two turns. You gotta draw something next turn. Yeah, I'm working on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. Another another six drop. What I wanted to see. Oh god. <laughs> uh, if only Norrin was a real creature, I think you'd be winning. <laughs> so Tober can is. just rip like a fireball or something and kill me. Ah, I don't run fireball. I think I have a comet storm. But uh, oh Norrin, if only you could block. <laughs> oh no, so two turns. I was hoping for Boon of Erebos for the win. <laughs> I can't believe this is happening. <laughs> Come on, cutthroat. <laughs> oh, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Wait, am I dead next turn? Yeah. If you take a Zulaport hit. Oh. <laughs> no. You didn't draw a creature? Ugh, it costs eight. You have eight. <laughs> you have nine. I know, but it doesn't really... <sighs> All you need is a blocker and you live. It's sorcery. <laughs> an, what? an eight mana is what, like insurrection or something like that? Is that kind of... <laughs> <laughs> Take that first. <laughs> no! Right. I will float. Alright. <laughs> insurrection. I'm taking it to the port. And I'm hit you with it. <laughs> <laughs> Take it. <laughs> Take All right. That. Oh, best insurrection ever. Amazing. Now, if only Nora just blocked one time. Moto <laughs> fail. Just one moto fail is all I ask. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> good game. <laughs> yeah. How did Richard win? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That was insane. I can't oh, believe it. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Good game, guys. Good game. <laughs> That's so silly. Yeah. That went whoa. a lot longer than I thought it would, too. Until that great aurora happened, and then things got serious. <laughs> wow, that was a good game. Richard had one mana source after the Great <laughs> yeah. Aurora. One mana source, and he somehow won. Yeah, yeah the Sorry, slowest man. start. For, like, just <laughs> land drop after land drop. Finally plays his commander, and then it dies. <laughs> then the roar happens. He has nothing. <laughs> and then he cleans house. Like, what? <laughs> oh. Oh, man. Profane <laughs> command for two, baby. <laughs> so I go. That's all you need. <laughs> So I saw you had you had like demon travel going on. What were the thralls? You have to tell us about the thralls. Uh, the there's thrall champion. All thralls get plus one plus one. And it's a two two, and you can oh. take control of target thrall. That's so, actually pretty decent. So that's the only legitimate thrall. <laughs> and then I had breeding pit, which is a four man enchantment. You pay two during your upkeep or sacrifice it. You get a zero one thrall every turn. And the rest of the thralls are just really bad. They're like sacrifice. Uh, a thrall to like get a plus one plus one counter and stuff like that. <laughs> so those ones didn't make it in. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. And wow, you you crushed it. <laughs> uh, I would say uh, you probably crushed it, and I <laughs> snuck in for the uh, last four damage there. <laughs> I was I was a bit shocked at how explosive my deck ended up going. Like turn one Norin into turn two, and then turn four uh, Pingers. 
Impact Tremors and then Perforos puts up quite a clock. And, and like as you guys said, there's not really much you can do to deal with Nora. And it turned out that Kervik had the answer on that one. But otherwise, you can't do you can't do any instance you can't do instance or sorceries removal. Just most abilities just don't work. It's only triggered abilities, and there's not that many available. I think maybe like Grave Pact effects would work, but even then. Norn's so cheap that you can just keep recasting him. So that was that was more effective than I thought it would be. I don't know. If maybe that I just had the nuts hand, and I didn't realize it when I when I decided to keep like grudgingly. But uh, it worked out very very well, and I'm I'm happy with it. I'd play something like that again. <laughs> so it certainly sped up the clock on our usual games. <laughs> that is for certain. And so did Kervik, I think, because. At, at that point when you guys decided, you know what, we have to kill Norrin or else we all die, Karavik started, like, I don't know how quickly he did the damage to me, but I know he did, like, 15 damage in, like, two turns. Mm -hmm. Just incidentally off other people's casting. So that was that was pretty intense. He, you could use him pretty politically, I guess. Try to go for, like, a political Karavik where, like, oh, I can deal with this threat if you don't deal with Karavik type stuff. Look neat. Did you have any other any crazy shenanigans in, in the deck? In the Caravac deck? Not really. I think it is. Uh, it very much feels just kind of like a deck that's filled filled with very strong black and red cards. I love uh, Puppeteer Click. Oh, uh, oh yeah. And I was I thought I was I was so close. I was like, all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get there finally, and then just the profane command at the end sealed the deal. <laughs> uh, but but overall, yeah, yeah the deck just uh, the deck plays out very well. I think if there's anything to take from the Karabek deck that I was playing tonight, it's that uh, if you feel like you want to play Commander and MTGO, t do it 100%. You can make like a competitive real deck for less than $10, and it's not even difficult. So I would heavily suggest trying it out. The most expensive cards are always lands, and even then, some really good Commander lands are less than $0.50. Cents. So yeah, absolutely. Definitely do it. <laughs> Seth, did you have more? Well, you, had, you said you had one combo, right? <laughs> yeah, sort of. Um, <laughs> I have been trying to actually pull this off for a lot of commander decks, and I've never done it yet, but there's a fungus called Spore Mound from, like, M something, 14, and it's a 3-3 three, three for 5, and it says whenever a land enters the battlefield under your control, you get a 1-1 one, one Sapperling creature token, and then there's okay. this really janky rare from Planner Chaos called Life and Limb, that says all forests and all sapperlings are 1-1 one, one green sapperling creatures and forest lands. So pretty much, if you get those on the battlefield at once, and you make one land drop, you create an infinite loop that makes an infinite number of 1-1 one, one green sapperlings that are also forests. And it just does that until Moto explodes, I guess. Like, you can't, unless someone has a removal spell to, like, stop it, it's just an infinite loop. And it, I think it draws the game, technically. It's not a May effect? <laughs> uh, it is not. It is an oh. involuntary, involuntary loop. Yeah, that would end it. That would cause probably the reset where we have to replay it again. So I was hoping that I could play all these really bad fungus creatures, and then right when things looked the bleakest and I was about <laughs> to die because my deck was horrible, I would just draw the game with that combo. But instead, I cast the Great Aurora, and that was pretty sweet. Yeah, that was sweet, and it was a good it was a good gamble too because it went from for sure dead to maybe dead, probably dead. Yeah, I was still pretty dead, but I was slightly less dead than I was if that didn't happen, <laughs> yeah. and it could. I'm just disappointed because it would have been so sweet. I When I was building a deck, I pictured in my head I would have all these funguses and I'd be getting these spore counters and removing them to get zapperlings. And I would draw like 50 cards with the Great Aurora when all of you would draw like 15 and I was going to win because <laughs> of that. But it didn't It didn't work out that way. Honestly, I, I think had had I not played a Norn deck and had that, that crazy of a start, you probably would have pulled it off too because... In no shape and form would I have went after you first. You didn't seem like a heavy threat. No offense, um, <laughs> but but it just so happened that Norn did, did damage to everybody, so that mm -hmm. didn't didn't play into the politics of that. Yeah, but, there's not, no. not very many good fungus creatures. Honestly, they're just all really slow. 
where you have you play them and they're underpowered when you play them, and then you have to wait three turns and your reward is like, oh, you can remove three counters and deal one damage or like get a one one token. So they're bad when they enter the battlefield, and even if you wait an infinity for them to do something, what they do is still not all that exciting. Yeah, you wait three turns, you get a one one. Oh, gotcha. I, got, I did. I did have doubling season to speed That's up true. the process and get two one ones, but I didn't draw into it. Did you have any proliferate? That could be fun. I did have some proliferate as well, so I, I had a few proliferate cards, uh, and then I had some overrun effects. That was kind of my backup plan: uh, overwhelming stampede, decimator of the provinces, to just kind of go wide with the one one tokens and trample mm-hmm. all of you to death. So, no, oh, really it was sweet. It, it was sweet. I think it was a fine deck. I don't know if it's very competitive, but it's flavorful. It has literally like every fungus ever printed in it. So, All right, that wraps up Commander Clash. Next week is the return of one of my favorite themes, Viewer Submitted Decks, where we play decks that you guys, the viewers, have submitted to us. If you'd like your deck featured in the next Commander Clash, post a link to your deck list in the comments section below. And as a general guideline, we're looking to pick decks that are fun to watch. So while a hardcore stacks deck or a turn three combo deck might be entertaining to pilot, it might not make for an entertaining game. So just keep that in mind when submitting a deck. And that's about it. I can't wait to see what crazy brews you guys come up with this time. So until then, see ya!